Right, so, there's a dark bramble seed on Timber Heart. And nobody believes me when I say we're in a time loop, which is, to be honest, as expected. Hmm. <laughs> okay, what do we know? Well, we can look at our notes to see what we know. Notes, 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 because the notes carry over. Okay, dark bramble seed, we discovered that. So, a seed from Dark Bramble crashed here and has already taken root. Tektite once used a scout launcher to get a look at what's inside. My signal scope picks up harmonica unit in the music when I aim it at the seed. I launched my little scout in the seed. Somehow the seed is much bigger on the inside. When I launched my scout into the seed that crashed from Timber Hearth, it ends up in a way bigger space filled with fog and thorny vines. It also gives me a duplicate signal because it's um, uh, winding up on Dark Bramble. So it's some sort of portal. Oh, that's gonna be where um, Feldspar, whoever owns the harmonica, got to. He, um, uh, there must be more of these portal things on uh, Dark Bramble, and that's where that's where he le where he went. Okay, right. So that's that. Um, let's see. Now then, question is: Do we go visit Dark Bramble now, or? We follow one of our other leads. That's the Hourglass Twins. That's the moon. You know what? Moon's closest. Let's start with that. No, that's... Uh, left stick. The Owl Rock. Somewhere... are Lunar Ruins. That's them there, I think. On... That end. Yeah. Now that's the landing platform. Where are the lunar ruins? Okay, match velocity. What does autopilot do? Ah, there we go. The lunar ruins. Okay, this is going to be an interesting landing. Ah, ugh. Okay. <laughs> uh, I am not qualified. Not in the slightest. Right. We got to the ruins anyway. Oh, oh, oh. No! <laughs> I forgot to put on my suit. Okay, yes, yes, yes. <laughs> Right. That was a, um, that was very short. Okay, thanks very much for watching, and I'll see you next time. Bye! Just kidding. All right, let's do that again, but less stupidly. Okay. I was wondering why my, oh, my flashlight. I do have a flashlight, even without the suit. Okay, suit up, suit up, buckle up, fly up. Ah. Uh. Right, where's the moon? Where's the moon? Where is the moon? Where's the moon? Did I happen to fly up on the other side of the planet from where I'm trying to get to? Okay, map. No. Map. Give me. I want to. Uh. Lock onto the moon. No. Apparently it's there. It's just too dark to see right now. Heck is... No, that's the Addle Rock. Okay, uh, match velocity. No, 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 no. Okay. Match velocity. Let's have some 
autopilot. Okay. There's a crash ship here. There's something. Okay. Ow. Ah. Rotate, rotate, rotate. Ugh. All right. Oh, that's the side of the first, um... Okay, I do have this. Yes, I have the suit. Okay. Ship, ship, ship. Ow. Okay. This will be the... F the f uh, our first landing on the moon, probably. Yes. Where's the... Okay, this way, I think. That's the camp. Dang it, where is, where are the ruins? I saw them right near here. Some light would be helpful. There's only so many directions it can be in. This place is very small. Here we go. Here are the ruins. Okay. Right. So we know that the Nomai can't we're here to calibrate or activate something. Okay. We've got like an exploding thing. Triangle, gas giant. Hmm. Huh. This is following. This is aligned with the ecliptic. From this point on the south pole, we can see all the planets. First of all, what's down here? We got a tree. We got more than one tree suggesting oxygen. Okay. I can translate this. Coleus, I was an up I was upstairs testing the eye signal locator, and we can hear and follow the signals from the sun, giants deep, and brittle brittle hollow. However, something strange has happened when I asked for the asked the eye signal locator to follow the eye's signal. The device indica indicate, in, rotates wildly and never points to just one direction. The eye. I see. Well, I most likely calibrate the look, uh, locator incorrectly. Privet, my apprentice, and I will make adjustments and try again. As a curious result, it's possible that the eye has stopped calling out its signal. An update. Disappointedly, everything is correctly calibrated after all. It saddens me to pause at this, my friends, but I believe the locator cannot detect the eye's signal. We need to build a more sensitive device if we want to locate the eye of the universe. Then we will build it. Don't lose hope, uh, Kasav. Our, our search for the eye is what brought our clan to this place. We won't give up so easily. Okay, the eye. Would that be the gravitational lens, perhaps? Hmm. No. Ooh, a scroll. Will that go here? Okay. Uh, where should this new, more sophisticated locator be built? It may need to be larger than the eye signal locator is. 
Anana and those of us originally stranded on Ember Twin built a quantum moon locator there, but the heat of the sun made its construction challenging. I wouldn't recommend building on that planet. There's a quantum moon locator on the sun, apparently, whatever that is. The southern glacier on Brittle Hollow has ample available space. I could construct a new building to house this, this, this proposed locator. Yes, let's build there. I imagine my young friend Kanoi will enjoy that immensely. He has always held a great interest in the eye, especially for a child born so, longer after, so long after the crash. I will begin construction immediately on Brittle Hollow's south pole immediately then. Okay. Okay, wow, I've seen this ruin in other travelers' pictures, I'm seeing it for myself. It's really old, isn't it? But wow, this is the coolest day of my life. Okay, um, time for some official notes. So this, so this is some kind of Nomai locator. It can point out the different planets, which is incredibly cool, by the way. But for what little I can understand, the writing here, I think it was built to try to find something specific? I'm not sure. I was able to translate something about the south pole of Brittle Hollow, so I'll fly there and see if I can learn more. Yep, just gonna get back in the old ship and take off. Totally safe. Mostly safe. Oh, stars above. Okay. So we're not the only one who was following this, uh... This trail. Okay, so they were searching for the Eye of the Universe, which is presumably the center of the universe. Hmm. Hold on, this whole... Facility is rotating now. Ah, it rotates when I step in here. Hmm. So right now, all of these holes... Oh, they're locked to the position of the sun. Yeah, yeah. Okay, this whole platform is now rotating. Let's see. Right, so that's the symbol for the sun. Okay, this won't stop rotating. This is what the... So this is... The, this is the symbol for the eye of the universe, which I mean, vaguely suspicious. Uh, no, is um, that gravitational lens there? Okay, signal scope off. That's the sun. Giants deep, probably. Yep, that's aligned to Giants deep. Here we have one of the hourglass twins, maybe? Yeah, okay, so these are, are probably sites that were important to them. Hmm, okay. Ah, that'll be the Nomai facility at the uh, South Pole. Okay. Right. And it looks to me like there's a landing pad there. Now, in one of my previous attempts, I've gone to those ruins, but I couldn't find a way in. But, if I can... <laughs> mind you, this is a big if. If I can manage to land inside that crater on that landing pad, I might find something more useful. Okay. Yes, it is. Big geyser here. Hopefully that does not flip me over. 
Ooh. Amazing. I did it. But wait a minute. We're not at the South Pole. So where are we? We're at the... Looks like we're at the equator. Okay. Ah, uh, there's another thing we can I can manipulate with the gravity. Okay. Get to that in a minute. So this leads out. This leads out to a broken bridge. Which Okay, so I can pass through this. Come to think of it, there's a bit of a mural down around here somewhere, I think, for my last uh, uh, last visit here. Oh, interesting. Yeah, we're on the equator. That notch there is aligned to the ecliptic. So the ecliptic is the orbital, orbital plane. Okay. So the Nomai were very interested in... Um, uh, astronomy, mapping the stars, searching for the eye of the universe, which I'm sure is um, related somehow to um, mining site 2B. Okay, so this was a mine. Up and over there. Okay. I wonder if I've gained some special ability to, to manipulate these gravitational things. Ooh, okay. Dead Nomai. Apparently they had birdie claws. So that's some sort of gravitational elevator like is found on my ship. Uh-oh. Well, now I'm underwater. So they've been boring holes into this. Which, you know, makes sense for mining. Right. So, molten core. Interesting. This starts here. And then up here. Based on the very geometric nature of the lines, I'm guessing that while it's more... Um, huh. Another skeleton. So they were mining the same rock that we do. But they died. More than one of them died here. Presumably quite suddenly. Okay. Onio, I'm still amazed by how much ore the Ash Twin Project requires. Isn't this the ore for the remaining towers being built for, the, for uh, on Ash Twin? The completed towers I've seen are quite large. No, the material for those towers is all being taken from Ash Twin. The ore we're mining here will be used to craft an immensely thick protective shell that will physically seal off the chamber inside Ash Twin's core. I'm relieved by our clan's decision to use Timber Hearth's ore only for constructing the shell. If eventually life on this planet were to evolve uh, to the point of advanced metallurgy, I'm confident we won't have destroyed their ability to create. This is fragment. Uh, they're sealing off all the entrances. I hope they've planned accordingly. I thought you would have forbidden your apprentices from making puns, Coleus. How else could he improve? Hmm. They're sealing off all the entrances to the Ash Twins core. Okay. Hmm. Let's see. Anything else? Anything this way? That goes down. Okay. Hmm. I only have a few minutes left. See what I can find. What is 
this. Pick up Ash Twin Projection Stone. Okay, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Seven of these things, three of which are glowing. Hmm. Okay, so I'm guessing that something needs to be activated on each of the planets. Somebody died here as well. And here. What of? Okay, so if I put this here, what happens? Ah, more writing. My gratitude for the latest shipment, Onio. Onio. Uh, Oino, this ore should be the last we'll need for the Ash Twin project. This is exciting news. Can I offer an extra set of eyes for the final check, specifically mine? If my work here is complete, I'll be delighted to help. We'd be grateful if you would. The more eyes, the better, uh, as the smallest flower opening in the shell that protects the Ash Twin project could lead to disaster. Once we finish the shell that seals off the central chamber, we'll check to ensure there are no longer any physical entrances. Remy and I will be uh, checking the interior and then the exterior for cracks, our final safety check. Okay. Hmm. This is a big facility. And I've only got, I don't know, maybe a minute or two before the sun goes nova. dead body. Draft. That didn't work. Okay. Something tells me I'm not going to find much useful here. It's been 24 minutes at this point. I'm going to stick around here, in here, for a little bit. Hmm. Because I don't think... I think the loop should have reset by now. Because there... It, it did take me a little bit to get from the main menu to here. But I don't think it took that long, so when I'm in no my spaces is time frozen? What will I see? Okay, well cycle's ending. Let me see if I can get a look at that mural in the time I have left. Especially now that I know I can, um, I, I know how to use my jetpack to jump. Um, there's unpleasant matter around here. Okay, here's the mural I was talking about. Trees. Big tree to Nomai. And a Nomai lander by the look of it. Hmm. Really big tree. Is the really big tree important? to say. 
None of these trees look big enough to be the really big tree. And here comes the loot. Hmm. All right, well, we're looting more. Still no idea what any of it means, though. All right. This um, is not a particularly good place to view the end of the world. Because that's what happened on my first attempt at this. I got stuck in that crater and couldn't see anything. Okay. Hmm. <laughs> right. Okay. I think that'll do it for this loop. Firefly. Learning more things? Don't know how it fits together yet. But we will, I think. We will. Until then, thank you all very much for watching, and I'll see you next time. Bye!